Alright, so I'm gonna go to the room now. Um, here at Veranda is where we're staying. At. Key in. The lights on. Right here's a bathroom. Here is the bed. Looks really, really good. Right here is a little, uh, some water bottles right here, some free water, coffee, tea if you want it right there. So later we're going to check out the pool and the gym and the uh, restaurant. Peace. So this room is quite big for a king size bed. Uh, it's good for relaxing. I mean, uh, just pull out. Get uh, out of here. Just chill. I like the pictures. I like the pictures a lot of here. Up here, uh, a lake with some trees up there, very relaxing. Fits the room nicely. <sighs> Come on, get up. All right, all right, get it done. All right, so we're gonna relax a little bit, then we're gonna head out and uh, see what's all around here. Area back over there, like a trail you go to. Yeah. All right, so this is the restaurant right now. This is before breakfast. This is close to dinner. Pretty chill. Pretty, pretty, you know, unique. Kitchen is. The is the heart of the home. That's true. Chef's cooking back there. They're getting ready for like a buffet or something. Alright, so now I'm in the water. Uh, pull behind me here. So walk backwards. We're gonna show you what it looks like. This is the pool. Just gonna walk around. Doesn't like to drop off. I think it's only 120 centimeters, 1.2 meters tall, so we're good. I get wet in the pool. Crazy here. So you get a view of a little park over there. And some people hanging out back over there. Stuff like that. Kids behind me playing. You know, this is a little good. So this has been like a little good getaway for tonight and evening. You know, relax, chill. Have our, get our minds right for the, for the week coming up. Man, it's gonna be crazy. All right. So this is pretty cool. They got the lights on now here. So this is the appetizers, some dumplings here. Okay, so we have uh, chicken feet here. Uh, it's like a croissant of some sort. Uh, dumpling and somai right there with some green chilies here of course some bitter melon right there bitter melon cracker right there some veggies and the appetizer from earlier so one person has their food we have appetizers for the rest of us let's see what's coming next all right so we got everyone's food here let's flip it around see what it looks like all right so we have uh, nasi manado the nasi inside the uh, banana leaf here some uh, Sambal there, something there. So some veggies, some chicken, 
Little crackers here. We got pesto over here. With some chicken parm, looks like almost. Broccoli, bread. Let's dig in. That's hot. Here we go unwrapping this. Whoa! Check us out. So we got some uh, sort of meats there. Sambal, anchovies. Just all in. Oh, that's gonna be delicious. No. Oh Take a little bite here. Coconut on top here. Looks like we got some uh, chicken here. Right there. Mmm. It's the lemongrass. Has a kick to it. Mmm. Ah. Want some? Let's put the rice in. Oh, that's spicy. Mmm. The coconut kicks, kicks back to spice. This is on point. This is my first time having this. Oh, it's delicious. That is so good. The smokiness, the tenderness, the spicy. Oh, I love Indonesian food right here. This is so good. Try some nasi goreng with uh, beef ribs. Some nasi goreng here, get it up on. There. Oh, the smoky tender. You can taste the beef rib and the, uh, and the nasi there. Oh, that's just. There's the beef rib here. You see, just look how tender that is. You just throw it right off the bone here. Just, they must have smoked this for a long time for it to be this tender. This is huge right here. Look, look how big this thing is. That's a lot of beef. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's delicious. Try uh, kaki ayam, also known as chicken feet, if it ever gets up here. Mm. Sweet. Crunchy. I'm good. Some point. Mm. That's delicious. Hey, good morning, everyone. So this is the view from our window. That's the uh, bus station right there. The street. See all the traffic down there. Window. It's a little smoggy. You see, I say foggy, but uh, it's probably small here in Jakarta. Foggy, yeah, foggy right now last night. So we're downstairs this morning getting ready to go to breakfast. And it's like this is their wine collection. Have a new Japanese place open? Sumoji. We're fat together. Ha! The sumo wrestler. That's cute. Restaurant for breakfast called Wild's Kitchen. Yeah. Alright, so we're gonna check out what they have for breakfast, you know. Coffee. Hot tea. Hot coffee. The coffee station there. Looks like they have a little bread station here. There, there's some fruits. A pineapple, melon, uh, papaya, water, melon, watermelon, salads, uh, infused water with oranges, orange juice. Carrying on, cereals. We have potato wedges and sausage. It's like a chicken sausage and some fried potatoes there. Chicken katsu curry. We have uh, chapte and some noodles here. We have some 
Nasi goreng, fried rice, normal for Indonesian breakfast. Then we have uh, soups. Well, there's rice right there. I'm guessing the soup is here, soup gulai. Over here we have uh, omelets that are pretty cooked. Pretty cooked omelets. Kodak will be put, put peace on. Over ayam ingredients right here. There's the uh, rice porridge there. And back there is the kitchen. Is that the sunny side up? Yeah, it's like, it's like the, yeah. yeah. Just order the sunny side up. I'm gonna get an omelet. I'm gonna walk over here and uh, get the food. I have a croissant. Got the croissant here. I have an omelet. Potatoes with chicken sausage right here. Chicken katsu curry. I got some melon and some papaya. I love papaya. And of course, I got some uh, mineral water there. So the croissants are so good. I had to give me another one. Check it out, this croissant. Look how this, I just picked it up, it's already flaking off. This comes off. Here we go. Here's the texture of the croissant here. The thing is on point. It's light, fluffy, it's not too buttery, and it's not heavy like you normally get it at a restaurant or a hotel uh, croissant. Man, this is awesome. So behind me, there's a croissant station. Croissant station over there, behind me. And they have a whole wide range of like, they have very good sandwiches. So if you're in a hurry for breakfast or whatever, you can just grab the sandwich and go. Um, they have the toast you can make, croissants. This croissant is amazing. Watch this, I'm just gonna dip it into the, the jam here. Just dip it into the jam here. Just dip it in here. Check this out. Oh, that's good. All right, on point. I love it. Here's a big piece right here. Here's a big piece. You don't, need to, you don't even need jelly fish. It's so good. There's a buttery Christmas, buttery taste to it. But it's not saturating your fingers. This is on point. Man, it's really great. I can eat these all morning. Restaurants inside. It looks like another restaurant's over here. Maybe they're remodeling it right there. We just got green all through here. This is freaking awesome. Have a little seating area out here. If it wasn't raining, it'd be great to sit out here with the green and everything. You can hear the traffic in the background because we're close to the road here. Uh, there's the bus trip, bus terminal up there. We can see it from our hotel room, but we're downstairs in the lobby. It's hard to see. Just lush, green, beautiful. This is a great rest, a great hotel with a great little restaurant to eat at for breakfast, for dinner, to come here. Uh, I would have to arguably say that this is the, they've had the best breakfast of any hotel I've had in Jakarta. And the, uh, the scenery, the ambiance is really, really great. Little sitting area right there, people to park up the lobbies right there looks like this is the spa area right here going there is a spa so this is the lobby area right here I'm celebrating Chinese New Year with all the decorations It's a big waiting area, pretty nice. A nice little gathering meeting area. It's pretty chill. I see edge right there. Waiting area is there. That's, that's all the traffic here. The main road coming here. All right, so this is the, the front entrance here when you walk, when you drive into a veranda. Here is a sign for a veranda right there. As you can see, completely green. This is a lower level parking area right here. Where you can see a little pathway here. Assembly point, all the green. It looks like a little walk around.
Like a little picnic area here for people to hang out at. Green, lush, look at this. These trees are just beautiful. Some bamboo back there. This is beautiful right here. It's like a, a little place to get your zen on, I guess you could say. Okay, so now we're gonna go to the fitness center. This is actually interesting trying to get to the fitness center was we had to get someone from the staff to actually allow us. The center is this way. Here. It looks like with the weight room lifting. Let's go inside, check it out. There's the bathroom with a shower and everything. Hmm, not bad. Not bad. They have uh treadmill, uh bicycle for you to ride on, a little bench. They have these all-in-one techno gym stuff going on here. This isn't bad. Here is another shower. Shower bathroom area for people to go to. So you take a shower here. So for every floor they have this for mosquitoes to keep them out. So that way people don't catch digging fever or reduce the amount of digging fever. So now we're going back to the room. Here is that they have a lot of cool pictures. Uh, Alright, so right now we're getting ready to check out. Uh, hey, it's been a wonderful experience here. Um, interesting to say the least. This is one of the greenest uh, hotels I've been to in Jakarta. It's been great. Uh, and so yeah, I have no, really don't have any much complaints about this place at all. It's been, it's been really awesome to experience here. And it, I will recommend it well. So, as always, we are going to leave the information for this hotel in the description box. If you have any comments or suggestions or if you have stayed here before, please let me know in the comment section. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you for watching. Peace out.